We're going to Croatia, boys. I mean, what's going on? So, when we hit June 7th at 12 a.m., it was before all of our folks back in Liberty hit June 7th. So technically, we're seven hours into the future, and they're seven hours in the past. So when we go home, we will technically be going back in time. <laughs> CJ, what's the scenario, man? Bro, we lost Gavin and Cole. <laughs> and Cole. It's kind of we just I lost everyone. <laughs> we gave them a little ring. What's the scenario now, dude? Uh, well, they gave a ring, they picked up, and said they're all the way ahead to KD. Yep. They're uh, all the way down there, so. Me forever. Quit filming. I was just ahead. So we're at the uh, Roman airport we're now. At Dude, we're at the mall. This isn't an airport. What the heck? This is insane. Guys, we just barely got it, but we, we got hey, it. We did. We made it to Croatia. This weather is beautiful. It's so sunny, nice. Pulling up to our bus right now. Uh, I think we're gonna go get some money, go get some food, and then go on a nice little hike. Dubrovnik, I think that's how you say that. We're gonna go get some food. Um, we're just kind of walking around. Look at this, Game of Thrones, official licensed souvenir. It is a very small city, but there's a lot of people here. Hey, we found somewhere to eat. Oh, mm. it's very hot, so I'll take a little nibble. Oh, dude. All right, here's a Trevi's food review of the Croatian fish and chips. A little tartar sauce on here. Well, Cole's not dead yet, so I guess it's good news. Mm. You think people like watching you eat food? I feel good. Very hot. Overall, this is a good meal, boys. What are your thoughts? Oh, yeah, it was worth eating breakfast out of a box and eating nothing in an airport, a plane, or an airport, and getting stuck in traffic for like an hour. Boys just finished eating. Um, now we're gonna walk around for like 20 minutes, and then I think we're gonna go on a guided tour around the city, and then maybe I think we're gonna go on top of this mountain up here. Should be pretty cool.
all the stuff out here is breathtaking. This whole city, everything around here, it's it's incredible. It's it's I don't know, it's almost indescribable to put all this stuff into words, but I'm glad I went. This has been an amazing trip and then to think this is only the third day. It's only gonna get better from here. Croatian smoothie test. That's pretty good. I mean, it's just a smoothie. It's all strawberries. How much was it? 49 kuna. <laughs> <laughs> that is literally just strawberries. It's just strawberries, that's it. Croatian cat. So we just wrapped up our tour around the city. Now we're gonna go up this gigantic mountain. Um, I think we're taking two vans up there and then we're gonna have a beautiful view of this like whole and ocean, sea, this whole area. What are your thoughts, Trey? It's beautiful. It's indescribable, man. So you see the images, like I look up on Google and I'm like, yeah, that looks cool. And then you come here, it's a completely different thing. Like, it's ridiculous. It's unreal. Made it to the top. Man. First stop. First stop. Going all the way up there. Change of plans, that water is way too cold. So we're gonna head up to the, the pool, I think, and then go eat some food afterwards. But overall, man, this is beautiful, dude. Full time, not gonna be bad. I'm so glad to get out of these things. Morning of day four. After we went swimming, we uh, all hung our stuff up on this railing. These shorts stayed up. These shorts stayed up. Those towels fell down. Guess whose shorts fell off the side of the house? CJ, what's up with that? Yeah, I, I don't know how to get my shorts, so uh... Nice breakfast time. Mm, good views and good food. So in addition for my shorts being dropped off the side of the building, we also locked the room key in the room. So we're gonna go talk to the front desk to get everything. Thing. So, <laughs> what happened was, I locked my fanny pack in a little safe, right? Because I didn't want my money to get stolen. So, I do that. I go downstairs to give them breakfast and then to give my shorts. Well, these guys couldn't find the key, so we just kind of left. And then I forgot that the key was inside my fanny pack, which we just locked in the safe. So we just walked out and now we're locked out. Uh, we talked to the lady at the front desk. She was like, yeah, I'll we'll send someone from housekeeping up. And then they're in pursuit of my shorts right now. We also have like 10 minutes before we need to get on the bus. Six minutes until we need to get on the bus. But you know, this is, it's the fun trip. Update, we made it into our room. We're chilling now. Let me see about my swim trunks. They're, they're still down there. Boys, it's looking like I'm gonna have to buy a new pair of shorts. I don't think the front desk lady ever got to them. So uh, we're loading up on the bus right now. Good stuff. All right, so we got to our, our boat location where we're gonna send off. I got me some shorts and some snorkels. Unfortunately, they weren't able to get my shorts uh, in time for our bus to leave. So I just had to buy a pair and they're like 60 bucks or so. But you know, it's in Kuna, so it was like 300. So it, honestly, it didn't slip my mind because I just thought everything was overpriced over here. But uh, they're all right. They're American shorts is the weirdest, the, the jockey brand. But we're chilling. Um, now we're gonna get on the boat, set sail, I guess. 
let's try and cross this road without dying. One thing that's really refreshing about this place is the diversity and culture. There's people from all over the world here and like, I guess this is starting to become a very popular uh, tourist spot. It's, it's nice to see. So I think we're going to go island hopping, which that's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, we're going to go to, I think, three different islands, basically at our leisure. So if we want to go like soon, like we can speed through it if we want, or we can just take our time. Um, first one, uh, Mirna or Tour Direct. All right, ran into a slight predicament. Uh, ran out of battery on my phone, or actually storage. Now we're gonna flip out the old handy dandy handy cam. And uh, anyways, what I was saying is, uh, okay, the first island, what we're gonna do is we're gonna just chill out. Uh, she said we're gonna stretch our legs per se. Then we're going to go uh, the second island to eat some food. Um, I think she said we can go swim there. And the third island uh, was the one with the nice beaches. That's very interesting. So we're approaching the meetup spot right now and we're just gonna be chilling out. I really hope we're getting on this pirate ship right here. That would be dope. But uh, it's not looking like it. Oh well. Are you recording? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm doing pretty well. We just sat and waited on the boat for a little bit. That was kind of annoying. Got some goggles so I can see underwater. I'm kind of excited. She said it's pretty clear and it seems pretty clear. So if I can see some stuff underwater, that'll be cool. Alright, we just got off the boat, had our first stop, about to get some information, go swim, so about to get in. Sad news, I didn't bring my GoPro, so you guys won't be able to see me underwater in this crystal clear, beautiful beach. Oh, it's so clear out here, I'll show you guys once we get closer to the water. Man, look how clear this water is. Some of our homies over there. Oh boy, how's the water, man? Dude, it's nice, actually. Really? Let me let me peep my feet in. Oh, that's a little chilly, chill, but yeah, it's not bad. It's honestly a little cool, but good stuff. Just got out of the water, bro. This whole trip has been insane. Swimming with the fish, like being able to have a snorkel in with goggles, going like way out there, and then just looking down into the water, that's insane. Like, you can see down, you see everything. Colt, I mean, you were pretty far out there. What are your thoughts, man? I think there's snorkeling uh, out here. I see something crazy, it's just. They have those sea urchins, like the, what are those? Or, sea urchins? Urchins, yeah, uh -huh. with like the spikes and the poisonous. They, those things are everywhere yeah, they were and even in the show and they're like hiding under like a rock or something and those things will mess you up and they're, they were just cool yeah i mean every every little shell you see is just like a tiny little crab just cruising along the bottom mm -hmm. just lice everywhere. you see a lot, a lot of wildlife out there uh we also hopped on a kayak and yeah, we went like way out, out there that was pretty <laughs> good stuff fun <laughs> trip so far man now it's time I believe we're gonna go to the second island and then go eat, cause time to munch, I'm hungry. How's this trip going? Good. Good? Outstanding. Back on the boat. I think we're gonna go eat now. Um, second island trip. It's right with the new flops. I haven't tried them on yet, so let's see how this goes. How many kuna was that? It was 100 kuna. Dude, listen to this. I go in the shop looking for flip flops and I'm like walking around and I find some. And then I like look around to see if there's anyone working like, so I can buy them. Mm. There was nobody. <laughs> so I walked around like, for like five minutes. I'm like, I'm going to miss this boat. I thought everyone's going to leave. So I walk outside and everyone was just standing outside confused. So I walk over to them and they're like, oh, we're trying to gather everyone. I'm like, well, I'm trying to buy these flip flops. And so I told Miriam about it. She's like, so, so she helps me. Mm -hmm. We walk back over. She like yells out some Croatian words. She talks to some people in the store next. And they said that the store to the other side 
like they cover for each other. Oh. So we go check to that person and then come over to the store. And then that girl comes back, the owner, <laughs> with food. That's where she was. Shake so, my head. a bottle. There you go. It's a long time to buy these like $12 flip flops. Are they little? I'm gonna laugh when these don't fit. They're gonna fit, dude. Oh man, do they ever fit. <laughs> Alright, Treyway. Are they comfy, bro? Oh yeah, they're comfy. Give us a flip flop review. Hold up. Yes. Yeah. I'm sorry, but the rest of you aren't here right now. <laughs> 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 oh, here we go. All right, we made it to the second island. We are on our way to the restaurant we're eating at. See you, Um, Interesting boat ride, I'll say that. <laughs> and into this uh, foreign guy. Uh, oh, hello. Nice to meet you. My name is Sven. Um, hey, Sven. Very, very happy to be here in Croatia. Uh, it's very good, very beautiful, very clean. Uh, we got on boat today, a very long boat. Uh, we are going to eat in a little bit. Um, the water was very cold, but I got my sunscreen on my arms. But I am getting a little pink. Where's the fish? Um, fish up. Just very fish happy up. to be here. <laughs> Made to the restaurant. Can't wait to eat this fish. Got our appetizer. Pretty good. Trey, what are your thoughts? Olive oil, some chicken, <laughs> olive oil. <laughs> Well, yeah, it's olive oil, like yes. spice, instead of like peanut oil, like some people cook it in. Mm -hmm. These noodles are good, got a little bit of tuna. It's really good. It's, it is really good. It's a well, little, this is chicken, there's tuna in these noodles. Really, really good. Fish came. What are your thoughts? It looks disgusting. <laughs> Dude, I'm going to enjoy myself while I eat this. Yeah, and I'm going to enjoy watching you gag. Trey, we're into our fish meal, and what do you want now? You want to eat my fish, don't you? My second fish. Yeah, this dude just came down and slapped the fish. <laughs> yeah, he's like, more fish? And they're like, uh, sure. Got everyone over here eating. Good time. Dad, what do you think? Good? Wait, Trey, what are you doing? Eating my fish. I, I'm like, I got fish from the start, bro. I knew this was going to be good. Yeah. I knew it. Turkish coffee, just taste this. Yeah, my, my oldest is the one that's eight. She's like, grandma. 
It's definitely different. It tastes a lot lighter than just like black American coffee. Um, you like how they prepare my food? That's pretty good, man. I, I think it's good. I'm not gonna lie. Maybe feel like you wake up, pour yourself a cup of this, enjoy the nature out here. It's a good day. Just finished eating. That was a good meal. Cole, what'd you think, bro? I like the uh, tuna sour tuna. Pasta? Pasta we had at the beginning. Yeah, that was actually really good. It was really I, I good. I was gonna like it, but I did. It was this great. The sauce was very good. Dude, like, it was, you put some like sort of chicken sauce thing yeah. on it. It was, it was, it was very good. fantastic. Yeah. Yep. So we, we just finished eating. That was a great meal. I had one and a half fish. I didn't even really want it. The guy just kind of put it on there and I was like, Slap okay. So I, I ate that, that Turkish coffee. That was really good. Um, there's also the little donut ball things. So that was great. Now we're heading back to the boat. And then we're gonna go to the third island, swim around some more, I believe. And then we'll be going back to uh, Dubrovnik to go do some more shopping. What did you boys think of the, the meal? Uh, I had the fish. I think we all had the fish. Except Trey, Trey's soft. I was talking about I had the fish. had a little bit of it. Yeah, he had the chicken. We both had the chicken. Baby. Anyway, we had the fish. I had two of them. It was very I thought he was gonna great. Cuss. Uh, the coffee was good, it was called Turkish coffee. <laughs> Uh, they had like the little like uh, donut rolls. Those are good. Cool. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah. Anyway, it was all really good. I thought so. The third island. Uh, we're gonna do a little more swimming. Uh, we'll be here for like two hours or so, and then we're gonna go back to Dubrovnik and then shop. It's a lot of urchins. Yeah. You can see it, all that little sea urchins everywhere. Might have to walk back that way. I don't want to Cole, what happened? Um, you know, I'm just walking along and the sea urchins started talking, so I had to give them the one two Mayweather. You know, he got a lick in, but I should also include that Trevor threw a rock at my chest, I'm trying to skip a rock. All right, we're back on the boat, yeah. heading back to Dubrovnik. Trey, what's up? How these islands been, man? The islands? Yeah. Like there, like all of them? All of them. Uh, this is probably the best island trip yet. It's yeah. a lot of fun. This is our last day in Dubrovnik. Um, we're going to chill out for the rest of the night. We're going to wake up at 6.45 and we're going to split Croatia. Um, there was very light vlogging today and that's only because one, this camera battery died and two, my storage on my phone ran out. So I'm on the wrong floor. So I had to resort to just my old ojos. But you know, I'm not mad because it was nice just being able to live in the moment, you know? So, some good stuff. Always gotta be flicking pics, man. What's up with this? What's up with this? All right, so Cole and I are at a dinner and they have shark here. That's shark right there. Let's, let's try it. That looks and sounds interesting and different. It's like chicken. I'm not even kidding you. Wild. Ken, hey, how are we doing? Pretty good. Pretty good? Emily Tobin, how are we doing? <laughs> Trey, you coming? Hurry up, dog. I'm coming, bro. I'm coming. 